Max Prairie Wings presents At The Line. For all you goose hunters out there, you gotta have those dogs hit out there and they'll spray it. We got two steps we gotta take to, to get this dog ready for that, that task. Number, number one, we gotta get him in that little thing. That's a pretty good sized dog. You know, he's a 70, 75 pound dog. This thing is ultra low blind, it's very little. So we gotta get him very comfortable going in there in and out on your own, because let's face it, you're gonna be laying out beside him, beside him in a finishing blind on your back. So he's gotta be very proficient at this. So you need to work on this no matter whether you're in your living room, your garage, out in the yard, wherever. He's got to be automatic going in there, okay? Now, what we're gonna do, once we get him going in there and he's doing real well, we get ready to start going on those first few hunts, we're gonna go back to this lease we've been using. And what I do, I've got me a, a stake here. And it's just a basic tie-out stake I use for the dogs. And what I'm gonna do, I take this and loop it through and just pull it through, of course, real simple, however you wanna attach it. Just pull this thing through and then in the mornings whenever we're goose hunting, we'll put this right outside, uh, right outside the dog blind and nail this in the ground, of course, and hook that dog. Because let's face it, I like putting this thing when I'm hunting basically behind me, behind me when I'm laying in the finisher that way he's out of harm's way, he's out of the blast cone or whatever. But if that dog were to opt to have break, it's hard to see him until he's already in the middle of that muzzle blast. Or even worse, he's in the middle of that gunfire. So keep him on this, this leash for the first few hunts. Now, as soon as you end up getting ready to do, you reach back, unhook him, he's gone. He's after your goose. I'm going to hook him up on this. I'm going to walk up here, I'm going to get down low with him. I'm going to start trying to get him to kennel in there. The word will be kennel. This kennel is on to or into. Kennel. 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 Good. Good. And we're just going to pet and love him, let him know that's the place we want him to be. Atta boy. Good boy, Blaze. Okay. Good boy. Then we're going to call him out. Here. You can tell it's not easy. This is a big, powerful dog. Really had to put some pressure on him to get in there. Kennel, kennel, here, sit. You can tell each time I do this, getting easier and easier and easier, I'm having to put less and less pressure on it. No, kennel, kennel, good, sit, very good, here. And when you get to the point where you can just say kennel, him going there on your own, you know you're making some good progress. Kennel, sit. I'm sure every serious goose hunter's got one of these in their living room and makes the dogs practice on this all the time when they're watching TV. But that's just part of it, right?